Apple released iOS 26 Beta 2 this week, here are the top five features and changes. Beta 2 updates liquid glass in the control center so that you can see the different items easier. The blur is more prominent, and also throughout the OS the same is true. So down at the bottom here in music, you can see they've updated it where there's a little bit more blur, but the liquid glass effect still remains. Within our ringtones, we have an all new one called Reflection Alternate 1. Default was the old one, here's the old one. Here's the new one. With Beta 1, we got an all new pins widget for music. Now we have a live radio widget. It works on iOS as well as in Apple CarPlay so you can quickly access your radio stations. Safari gets an update. Down at the bottom, the menu is changed. And if we go into our options, we have all tabs, bookmarks, and more where it's been rearranged at the bottom. You can quickly slide between, and if we go into all tabs, you'll see that it's changed as well, where we can slide between our different tabs and it looks a little bit different. Within our cellular options down at the bottom, it now allows us to transfer our eSIM to an Android phone. Tap on transfer and then bring your Android phone nearby and you can transfer the eSIM without moving your physical SIM as iPhones in the US don't have a physical SIM. There's also a new recovery mode that allows you to restore your iPhone without a Mac or PC. And there's many more features in iOS 20 along with the others that I cover as well. Be sure to check out my channel and subscribe.